state-of-the-art technologies, innovative business strategies, behind the scenes, insights from cutting-edge users around the globe on World Business Review. Heightened security has created the need to better protect containers and vaults. New technology from Lagarde offers more than a simple lock and key solution. Obtaining the most assured method of identification in regards to security access is at the forefront of industries worldwide. With a complete spectrum of security locks, new products are simplifying security through biometric access. We offer products that are specifically for containers. The containers can be described as lockers, safes, ATM machines, and vault doors. The reason we have a variety is because different people, different markets, need different features. While keys can easily be lost and costly to replace, simply having a code for identification is not enough. Utilizing biometric access products such as SmartPoint could offer the most secure method of ensuring and auditing entry. SmartPoint is a technology that we've developed that uh, recognizes fingers that are being presented and it's used for quick access by the use of a human characteristics which, which can't be transferred. Of the many types of biometric identification available, the technology of finger point recognition is the most practical for the many markets addressed through the various products manufactured. The smart point itself is uh, using a technology we call light emitting sensor and there are various technologies to recognize fingerprints that are on the market. They all have some inefficiencies when we talk about the environment that our locks are going to be going into, fast food operations, warehouses, uh, there's all kinds of uh, deterioration that could occur. Uh, we found a product and a technology that will allow us to put it in all these different environments that overcomes these issues. While there are still concerns as it pertains to biometric access, the need for emphasizing and reassuring security is being addressed by capturing finger points, not prints. Fingerprint would be, in essence, a, a photograph of a fingerprint, and our, the technology does not do that. It looks to try to, to capture points of recognition that are unique and significant. Those things can be ridges, depths, whirls, and in our case, uh, there's a pulse and temperature involved. Those points of recognition are what we use to reanalyze whether a finger that's being presented is the finger that's going to be authorized or denied. So it's not a fingerprint picture, it's points of recognition that it looks for. Through the use of light emitting sensor technology, reliability and accuracy are provided in a cost effective manner. Light emitting sensor technology is unique because of the way it recognizes certain presented fingers. Uh, there are, as I said, various technologies that are on the market, but uh, as an example, ours needs a live finger. Uh, there are other technologies that can be, as we term in the industry, spoofed by the use of latex fingerprints or gummies. Uh, you can't do that with light emitting sensor technology. It actually recognizes that it's a live finger that's being presented it's rapid in identification and it's accurate in identification. By evaluating various technologies and diligently understanding the features of security that customers require, Lagarde is unlocking the future of biometric access. For World Business Review, I'm Christopher Thomas reporting.